Why? Do you like YouTube that much? It's really cozy. Is it's it? a, yeah, it's a super cozy hoodie. But it's Christmas week. And it's red and white. But and it's that's not Christmas a Christmas jumper. Crash Bandicoot. What? What? what, what? <laughs> I don't own a Christmas jumper. That's a lie. I'll tell you what. For the last, you had for the Christmas Day video, I'll put my Christmas jumper on. No, that's not even a Christmas jumper. It is. You it's know, got the skull. skulls that's on fine. it. That's Christmasy. Eh? No. It makes me look like I've got moobs though. Really? I mean, I do have boobs. It makes me look like I've got, you know, big chonking badonkadonks. Oh, you're in such a nice mood. Yesterday, I, I do this as if like I'm not on this. Yesterday? yesterday Don't get close to me. <laughs> Queen wave. We filmed a, a movie on my channel and it's like a different guy. What do you mean? It's like a different guy altogether. Like, you just like to wind my viewers up so much. Mm -hmm. And then we put the movie on. He's like, that movie was amazing. And I'm that like, was a great movie. And I'm like... Should go and this... watch that. I'm like, this is Wait, is that today's movie on your channel? Or... No, it's... Tomorrow's movie? Uh... I don't know. It's a space-time continuum. It's I all messed up. I think that's today's movie. Well, after you watch this, go after watch that. Go watch that one. Great. But he, like... To be honest with you, all the movies we've done on your channel is great anyway, so it doesn't matter what day it is, it's going to be a good movie. How many times did we do the intro? Seven. Did you get done over me? Seven. What was nine. I going to do? I was talking about you. Anyway. Anyway. What am I supposed to be there for? I'm the one people come for. You're just a window shopping. Okay. Take it away. Oh, we're watching Harry Potter. Harry Potter. What's the actual title? Harry Potter! And he has no prints in it. He's the half blood. No, he's not though, because his mum and dad were both wizards. Oh, okay. Well, I just assumed. Get your Christmas jumpers on. And let me know. Us know but in Voldemort's the comments. But Voldemort's not half blood. Maybe it's Prince Charles. I got um. It was Prince I, Charles at this time. Come on. I got a Harry Potter Christmas jumper, so hopefully it'll be here for the finale because. Harry Potter. <laughs> no, tomorrow we're not doing any Harry Potter. Is it? We only have this one here today, and then we've got two left, is that right? Yeah, and that's a part one and two, so we might as well just put that all in one video, uh, about six hours. No. Nope, we're not, okay, we're no, not we're doing not, that. We're not doing that. Part two nope. will be on Christmas Day. <laughs> I thought I thought a Christmas Day movie was going to be The Secrets of Grindelwald. Well, you can go and watch that, and you can do, like, triple the work. Oh, the alarm's going off! Oh, jeez! <laughs> what am I doing? If you want to watch this unedited with us, make sure you head on over to the Patreon. Link is in the description. Or head on over to the website, suzylou.co.uk. Are we even going to discuss remotely? Because we don't tend to discuss too much. Did you know that the guy who played Gilderoy Lockhart was, in real life, married to Professor Trelawney and cheated on her with Bellatrix Lestrange? So basically, he was dating the the one with the the spectacles, the kind of edgier character, and then he cheats on her with the, one with the sexy one. And oh, she's not I wouldn't say even, she's sexy. No. Well, okay, trashy. No, one? that's your 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 willy shrivels up if you just look at her the wrong way. To be fair. Oh, well, I'm not a guy, so I wouldn't know. So that is medical phenomenon. Willy shrivel. Oh. No, what? hold on. I was, <laughs> so, after we stopped filming, well, we kind of touched on it in yesterday's video, but after we stopped filming, I went on a, a pure, like, a pure, tangent, pure tangent of copium that I don't think... Oh, so you did. That's yeah, right. and this went on for a while. Oh, it did. But, like, I don't think serious. <laughs> you can't be serious. <laughs> I don't think he died. Like, he ended up... I'm getting kind of toasty talking about this because I can just hear the comment section. I don't think he died. I think that the middle thing kind of sucked him up and he's in some other kind of dimension somewhere. We end up having to skip back in, in the movie and everything and rewatch the scene. Yeah, but you did kind of say that maybe I was onto something. Maybe. I always say, if you've been following the Game of Thrones stuff or any of the other stuff that we've done, mm -hmm. if you don't see the body, they're not dead. It's just any other body. time, like when Batman died, freaking Batman, you saw his body, you know, and everyone kind of cried over we him. Don't and talk it was about, like we don't a... talk about this. When, when someone dies, 
And other Schnoovy... Oh, that Batman, all right. Sorry, I thought you were talking about a different Schnoovy. Keep up. Oh, sorry, yes. I know the rules that we don't That's spoil because he's, other shows. That's because he's not Batman to me, okay? I don't care about your edgy The Batman movie. I think it was all right. Um, when he died, you saw the body and everyone kind of cried over it. Yeah, when the but Twilight But whereas guy. this guy kind of flew up into the middle thing, you know, the thing that was in the middle of the room. I mean, it did look like a, a wiggly woggly ghost, but... That could have been because of that middle thing. We don't even I'm know not what that was. I'm not convinced. Maybe that was a door from that movie that we watched on your channel. Which you can watch today after this one. You're very hyper. Are you okay? Don't know what you're talking about. Ah, it all makes sense now. I've just got it in my head. The good news is that by the time this video goes up, we'll have watched all, all the main Harry Potters. So then I'll know. The main Harry Potters? Are you trying to tell me that the prequels don't count as a main Harry Potter? You try to tell me that the cursed child doesn't count as a main Harry Potter? I don't know what you're talking about. You do. I remember seeing the cursed child when in the theatre when we were in London. You had a cursed child. Do you remember that? We took a video in front of it and I was like, Harry Potter! Probably. Yeah, and then the, <laughs> yeah, that's right. And then you filmed me doing something else and then when I looked at the film bag, you were actually filming another girl's butt. Probably. That happened. It's in one of our other vlogs from 2016. Oh, really? Yeah, it's in what the vlog. What were we doing? We went down for Capcom. Capcom? Yeah, and I asked you to film me in front of the Harry Potter. So I, I, could, I could do like a nice walking, you know, vlog thing. And when I looked at it back, you uh, filmed another girl. And she. it wasn't even like, oh, damn, she was sexy. It was like, you just did that so you didn't have to film me. I can't remember this, therefore it didn't happen. There's video evidence that it didn't no. happen. Boy. What? No, it's fine. It's fine, don't worry. It's a right. forgery. This movie is AI. long enough. Okay. This Two and a half hours. Get. <laughs> Come on, watch the bloody movie we waiting for. Stop shouting. It's two and a half hours long. I've got places to be and people to see. You don't have any friends. No, I don't. <laughs> it's funny and sad at the same time. It's funny because it's sad. Yeah, let's do this. Let's not. I'm excited. I've got Nelson. He's my friend. And Sackboy, but he's in the bed. Do you know what? Him. I can understand why they don't give this, whatever this nonsense is to kids. Because if this is what it does to an old man, I can only imagine what it does to kids. This stuff is bad. I now have to deal with a hyper talking please don't, Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Please don't, please don't slander the good name of Monster. Um, Not it's full, I've literally just opened it. You can see it's full. You can can see, I watch the movie now? Can I see a liquid? Can you see a liquid? See? It's full. Hey, boy. Was the Warner Brothers thing always as like dark and grey as that in the earlier ones? Or does that kind of symbolise that they're, been changing that they're getting darker yeah, along so. the way? Also, I still don't have an owl, but I'm working on it. I can do your magpie. The yogurt? Magpie the yogurt? Oh, it's, no, it's a mud pie, sorry. Oh, <laughs> oh excuse me. I love the way that Dumbledore is kind of looking after Harry. Just, there's going to be a lot of mental health issues going on in this poor boy. Just a couple. Jeez. You know, parents were murdered. Fat guy tells him he's a wizard. Your, ad, your current family just hates you. Hate you, make you live under the chairs, the chairs, the stairs, and the chairs. I had um, a friend in primary school who used to stay under the stairs. Is it Harry well, there's the gherkin! We'll be there this week. Mm. The, the gherkin. This scene is so dark, it might as well just be in black and white. Zack Schneider had a go at this one. No, keep him away from all movies. I had the chance to actually go and meet him and have tea with him, do you remember? Yeah, you did. I turned it down because he's just not my cup of tea. Ah! That's for the new movie that he's doing, oh. You know how many I, people, I don't, like... I'm, I'm still not sure if we can talk about that, <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, it's fine. Oh, okay. Screw. Oh, Diagonale! 
Jeez. Okay. Hey, what are they robbing? Oh, wands! That looked like a person they just robbed. Oh, it was Ollivander, the wand shop man. Said so right above the window. I remember the wee old guy was like, well, you want a wand, are you? Give this a swish. Okay. Christ. Oh, it's like the, it's like the squinty bridge in Glasgow. <laughs> it kind of sometimes does that if you jump on it as well. Okay, is, that, not that. is that not the bridge that got, had to get taken down? Is that like the Millennium Bridge or something like that? Had to get taken down because the, the resonant frequency of people walking almost like broke the thing. Almost caused that to happen. Yeah. It was a Millennium, Bri Millennium Bridge, I heard that. Malfoy. That's Caban's latest Harry residence. Potter. Yeah. Who's Harry Potter? Me. No one. Bit of a toss already. <laughs> Jesus. If someone was like, are you Susie? I wouldn't be like, nah, she's a proper bitch, yes, that girl. Me, that's not me. Really? <laughs> well, I was going around a tweet. <laughs> she's cute, Harry. He's already got a girlfriend. Who? The Scottish lady. Oh, yeah, sure. You can tell me all about that toss of Harry Potter. I'll show you it hadn't been a tosser, baby. <laughs> I don't know how he got me. This guy has no game. Me too, Harry. You just popping pills in the kitchen. Kind of really like dark vibe already from this movie. It's so different from the first one. Like we've come a long way. Hey! Double doors. Hey, Dad. Magic. Oh, but you, your lady friend. I think he's got more important things to worry about. Such a cock block, Dumbledore. Oh, unpleasant to behold, isn't it? The tale oh. is thrilling, if I say so myself. Oofed. Is that Take from the own. last fight with Voldemort? No, I was just saying, it's, it's, it's not going to tell you the story. Do as I say. Take his arm. Wait, Dumbledore's a port key? Most people vomit the first time. No! <laughs> Can't imagine why. <laughs> what are we now? On the outskirts of London. Welcome to the charming village of Budley Babbitton. There you go, Budley Babbitton. Wands out, Harry. Get your wand out. What? Too good to be near me? I don't think Horace is doing too well. What was that other movie where they shout Horace and it's dead? Oh, The Mummy 2. Uh-oh. Why, Dumbledore? That's so disgusting. Old men are weird. At least he's got glasses on when he's looking up. Mm, yes. Hey, Winnie. Look at his feet! Yeah, Horace is a chair! No need to disfigure me, Elvis. Well, I must say, you make a very convincing armchair. They did apart from the feet. Harry, I'd like you to meet an old friend and colleague of mine, Horace Slughorn. Why is he sitting in the dark? <laughs> you know who this is. Harry Potter. <laughs> it's a bit of a toss that I hear. Muggles who own this place are in the Canary Islands. Well, I think we should put it back in order for them, don't you? I don't know, I was going to say, why is he living like such a slob? I think he wants it to look wrecked. So they won't come in and find him. Halcyus Rapero! Oh man, this is what I need for cleaning the house. Not that my house looks like that, of course, but... Could you imagine? Are you standing on a piece? Thank. That was fun. <laughs> Do you mind if I use the loo? No, of course. Why are you it's asking him? House. It's not his house. The answer is still no. Absolutely and unequivocally no. Well, if you're not going to join the Death Eaters, you might as well join the Dumbledore's army. Order of the Phoenix. You look very like your father. Mm. Oh. One of my best friends is Muggleborn. She's the best in our year. Oh, please don't think I'm prejudiced. No, no, no. It was there, but he was a teacher. How must be hard though, like the amount of times people were like, "Oh, your parents." It's like, yeah, I know. Oh no. Like they're gone. 
Greenog Jones, captain of the Hollyhead Harpies. Free tickets whenever I want them. Must have been a good teacher then. Regulus Black. You no doubt know of his older brother Sirius died a few weeks ago. Oh. Yep, unfortunately. I got Regulus when he came along, of course, but, but I'd have liked the set. <laughs> <laughs> Not Pokemon. You mind if I take this? That Playboy Mac. Well, oh, knitting. I do love knitting patterns. I just it had the pink across the top. I thought it was a Playboy mag. I would have considered it a great personal triumph if you consented to return to Hogwarts. Oh. Well, bye bye, Horace. Bye. Oh. He didn't. He didn't realise that it was to go back to Hogwarts, did he? Well, what did he think it was for? Order of Phoenix. I don't want Professor Merrythought's old office, not the water closet I had before. And I expect a raise. These are mad times we live in. Well, he shall be protected <laughs> at Hogwarts. He seems like a nice fella. He's definitely not a creepy dark arts teacher. Professor Snodgorn is going to try to collect you, Harry. You would be his crowning jewel. Pokemon. You need to get the legendary. The legendary Harry Potter. Harry Potter! Put him on your mantelpiece. Oh, you'll not be returning to Little Winching tonight, Harry. But, sir, what about Hedwig? And my trunk? It's already there. Imagine even asking that. It's bloody Dumbledore, mate. <laughs> Aww, it it must be nice, though, to just be like Dumbledore's fave. Just drop them in a, in a, a, a marsh. Bog. A bog. A boggy marsh. Right outside the Weasleys. I want a Weasley Christmas jumper with a big S on it. Well, then you have to make it yourself. Hedwig. Mom. Yeah, me, me, Grim, jump over the big heads. We could share that. What? Harry, Harry who? Harry Potter, of course. There's trunks in the kitchen. And is Al. Harry no, Houdini. I seriously doubt that. Um, maybe go down and have a look? I think I'll know if my best friend was in my room, wouldn't I? Is that an owl I heard? You haven't seen him, have you? But your missus is in your room. Hey. Oh, keeping your pants, Jenny. She got really tall suddenly. That's what that was my growth spurts. Got a bit of toothpaste. Oh, alright, Ron. God. A bit close there, aren't we, Ron? So when did you get her? A few days ago. Though for a while I wasn't sure I was coming. Why do you just chill at the Weasleys? I said Ginny and I had no business going back to Hogwarts. But it's too dangerous. Come on. She's not alone. She's trying to protect her. I mean, there's always a little bit of drama at Hogwarts. Dumbledore's got a bit old. What rubbish. What, he's only... What is he? A couple of grand. grand. <laughs> you guys weren't there. You didn't see all the... I was saying, ma, you blah. missed up. You didn't see nothing, okay? Nope. He's still got another hundred years in him. Oh, Draco. Oh, oh daddy's nice command. Oh, oh, no. Oh, Draco, oh, oh, no, 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 Draco. He's still gonna have an attitude in Hogwarts. I would just not even let him in. The Dark Lord's mistaken. Who do you trust? Who do you not trust? They managed to get all the prisoners out, though. Like, back into... Because there was a no. whole bunch of them that escaped. No, Bellatrix. And also, there's a big hole in the side of it. So, how could they keep anyone in there? You just got your dad in to do the drift work. That is good Two days have that entire thing back up. Oh, not this guy. Run along, one tail. Why are you talking to her? Why is he talking to Wormtail? Peter Pettigrew. If the Dark Lord has forbidden it, you ought not to speak. Put it down, Bella. We mustn't touch what isn't ours. Is that Malfoy's more? I'm aware of your situation, Narcissa. You? The Dark Lord told you? Oh. You should be honoured, Sissy. Asher Draco. He's just a boy. I can't so, change the Dark Lord's mind. So Malfoy's like Sirius's stepnephew? Nephew in law? Or something? Make the unbreakable vow. But I liked you though! When it matters most, he'll just slither back into his hole. I see what you did there. I see in the pun there. Take out your wand. 
See, I always knew that he was a bit of a shady character. Mm. I told you. Watch over Draco Malfoy. Watch over them. Protect him from harm. I will. Protect him from harm. If Draco should fail, will you yourself carry out the deed? Oh my god, what's the deed though? Kill Harry Potter? It's always killing Harry Potter. Well, normally it's killing Harry Potter. I will. Does that mean that he would come for Harry? Well, we don't know what that is, do we, really? Well, it's not good if he's in the same room as <clears throat> the killer. And Draco's Maw and Peter Pettigrew. I don't care about the rest of them. I just care about her because she's a murderer. Oh, whiz bangs and do boxes. We've got facing fences. Those lead new guard are just in time for school. I feel like I should be shocked, you know? I should be like, oh, this is awful, but... I've always felt like he was a dodgy McDodger. A dodgy yeah. one. So it doesn't surprise me. No doubt they've got like a. That they've got like a weird joke shot. Either Harry is incredibly short, or those guys are seven foot. Yeah, they are quite tall. You're doing just fine on your own. Meaning? Are you not currently dating Dean Thomas? It's none of your business. Ooh. See if a guy looked at me like that though, I'd be like, why are you up and down in me oh, like that? Five Not even hot. I'm your brother. Ten galleons. Oh. I can't imagine what it would be like to have twin brothers. Oh god. <laughs> oh, they're all getting like something. I shall get to that age now. Oh, Daenerys, keep your dragons in check. <laughs> Spoilers. Fred reckons people need a laugh these days. I reckon he's right. It's not Willy Wonka, isn't it? Never seen it. Everyone got that once from Ollivanders. That wasn't just shut down, man. I got ransacked. Oh yeah, that's like Glasgow. <laughs> <laughs> Leave it be. Is it me or do Draco and Mummy look like two people who don't want to be followed? You'd think that they would have Fenrir Greyback. You think that they would have some people like watching what they were doing? Oh you? yeah, they weren't allowed to be shady. Like your dad but... is literally linked to Voldemort, and you're just allowed to do what you want. And I bet he sells Avon. Hundred percent. Morgan and Merck. Was that not the place that Harry ended up when he diagonally? He don't wanna. When he went diagonally. And ended up in a weird place with a hand that tried to arm wrestle. <laughs> I have no idea. And the, the heads that you were like, that's not real. I have no idea. Oh my god, your memory is like a I know, it's fish. terrible. Welcome to the 30s. The th it's 2020. <laughs> and you lived in the future. <laughs> Shut up. Ah, your hair is still yellow. Mm, caress the box. This was my father's favourite box. I love this box with all my heart. You shall be my new father box. Wait a minute, that is Fenrir Greyback! I seen him in a wanted poster! That's Wolverine's brother. No, it's not. Gotta keep an eye on him, Harry. I said to you though, did I not? I've been waiting for the movie that we can finally get some... Yeah, the evil blonde boy turned out it was an evil blonde boy. I know, but like I've been looking forward to seeing him being more evil. Hmm. What's a Raxbat? Invisible creatures, they float in your ears and make your brain go fuzzy. That sounds disgusting. I love her character. I feel like she'd get bullied a lot though at Hogwarts. Oh, she's a bit weird. A lot of bullies at Hogwarts. There is a lot. Stop it, Harry. I know where you're going with this. It's happened. He's one of them. One of what? A Death Eater. Harry is under the impression Draco Malfoy is now a Death Eater. You're barking. But would you know who wants a sod like Malfoy? He just wants people. You're trying to tell me that he wasn't close to his dad and, you know, two and two. Sorry, Tom only saw it with her own eyes. I told you. I don't know what I saw. Why are you being like this? I don't know. You guys are not good friends. <laughs> Just decided. <laughs> imagine you know. being, but imagine being in denial about Malfoy being a bad guy. I know, I mean, come on. He's bullied all three of them. 
Okay, why um, why are we getting the looks? It's just like the creepy Slytherin carriage. Is this the one they said I'd be on? Yeah. Does that mean I'd be a dark Death Eater? Probably. I'd be damn good at it too. You're partial partial to a bald man with no nose. Relax, boys. It's probably just a fancy messing around. Come on, Draco. Sit down. We'll be at Hogwarts soon. Yeah, sit down, Draco. Let's just see. I don't think you'll see me wasting my time in charms class next year. <laughs> Amused, Blaze. Yeah, Blaze. We'll see just who's laughing in the end. All right, Mr. Edgy. Yeah, what, what? My dad in prison is yours. Yeah. Yeah, is your dad in prison? Well, that's how he's acting, though, isn't he? Like, so much better than all of y'all here. Dougie. I mean, to be fair, Malfoy just thought he was better than everyone anyway. You two go on. I want to check something. Did he leave his toner on the chain? Probably already on the platform. No, he knows that something's amiss. Come out, Potter. I can sense you. Come out, Potter. Didn't Mummy ever tell you it was rude to eavesdrop, Potter? Put your mouth in the palace! Kiwi! <laughs> well, I think there's a wee invisible boy sitting there. He's using his green screen. She was dead before you could wipe the drool off your chin. I don't think he's there. <laughs> Oofed. That's for my father. Until you ride back to London. Ah, he just knocked him out. I thought it was like a clone or shadow clone jutsu or... No, no, he, he, he used Petrificus Totalis, which I can only imagine petrifies you. What he doesn't realise though is he gets special perks and he'll be back. Oh, it's a Nurgle. Aww. I like your glasses. He's gonna wake up and be like, bah! <laughs> How do you know where I was? We're experts. Your head's full of them. Yeah. Probably. He just gets away with so much though. Using a spell on another pupil and then kicking him straight in the nose. I know. I think I have CCTV on that train. About time. I've been looking all over for you two. Doesn't seem like you've been looking anywhere, mate. Who are those people? Auras. Security. Oh. Why have you got a walking stick, mate? Are we now trapped in here or what? Because that seems yeah. creepy. I can vouch for Mr. Malfoy. Oh, can you? Ow! Oh, funny. I'm on to you. Nice face, Potter. That's my cane that I use for being edgy. Because I'm the wizard version of a mall ninja. Imagine being a bully and then openly like admitting to attacking another pupil in front of two teachers oh. and nothing. Not really Have you ever fixed the nose before? No, but I've done several toes and how different are they really? I mean the rhyme, so. What does nose turn into toes? Oh God. It's oh. 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 What did you just say? <laughs> no, your nose looks better. How, how do I look? Exceptionally ordinary. Brilliant. Just what I you always her. want to hear off of. A girl. There's nothing wrong with being ordinary. Oh, yuck, is he oh. eating jelly? What is it though? Is it jelly and rice pudding? He's covered in blood again. Why isn't he always covered in blood? Well, it's just a natural state of being. Look at your face. Later. What have I missed? Why would he not just say, like, oh, yeah, so and so, like, kicked me in the face? It takes two know. seconds to say the sentence. Of pie, the profiteroles do it for me. The newest member of our staff. Oh, Christ. Hey. Oh no, we like this guy. That's Honest. right. It's, it's fine. It's not a creepy yeah. lady. Post, as oh. Post of defense against the dark arts will be taken by Professor Snape. Oh God. Well, it's all, it's what he always wanted, you know. He says that in the last movie. I know, but now I don't trust him. <laughs> It's always a defense against the dark, dark arts teacher. And you have the right to know why. You also have the right to remain silent. Walked this castle's corridors. Stepped under its roof. Sorry, I was really distracted by the guy at the back. A little finger at the back, Like, yeah. what's he doing? Tom Riddle. Oh. Every day, every hour, this very minute, perhaps. 
And one of you could be a Tom Riddle. Their greatest weapon is you. Has he got his wand in his hand about to do something? I don't think he's about to do something. That was cheerful. I think he's just been generally threatening. I think he's just half asleep, more like. I bet Dumbledore knows. Mr. Davis! Mr. Davis, that is the girl's lavatory. That's alright, it's 2023, honey. Potter. Oh, this can't be good. Nope. <laughs> Professor Slughorn is perfectly happy to accept new students. Oh! Potter, take Weasley with you. He looks far too happy over there. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> go on, Ron. Got a new class. He's like, no, I was just chilling. Ron Weasley, sir. But I'm dead awful at potions. I mean, it's actually, so I'm probably just gonna. Did you Aww. see her Manny's face, though? Yeah. She was like, what's your deal, girl? That one there is Barris Siren. It's a truth-telling serum. And give him the give, give Ron the nice one. Ah, uh, guys, you just got there. Mrs. Amortentia. This is best friends for you, isn't it? Yeah. For example, I smell freshly mown grass and new parchment and spearmint toothpaste. Interesting. It does cause powerful infatuation or obsession. Probably the most dangerous potion. Yeah, definitely uh, keep it away from all the girls. That's a Slytherin girl that was on the train. But it is more commonly referred to as... Liquid luck. Yes, Miss Granger. Seriously, how does she know everything other than... Smart. I, like, I don't think she does the time thing anymore. Have you met me? I don't have a time thing. Only once did a student manage to brew a potion of sufficient quality to claim this prize. I like liquid luck. Let the brewing commence. We all know who's going to get it though, right? This book is the property of the Half-Blood Prince. That's like the name of the schnoovy. Jesus! <laughs> There's Clark turning the back of the head. He needs to go to home ec. Oh, Malfoy's in this class, is he? Yeah, it showed him a second ago. Crush with blade. Ah, he's got a wee cheat book. The instructions specifically say to cut. No, really. She's such a like goody goody two shoes. Me and her would never get on. Oh. We need to follow the instructions. Rules are made to be broken. Oh. Look at her hair. <laughs> Slaves back to first year again. 13 beans juice, just beans, beans of juice, juice So of I beans. like that he's clearly got the book of the one person that managed to do this. Oh, he's got the hack book. Merlin's beard, which is perfect. So perfect, I dare say one drop would kill us all. <laughs> but he cheated though, he had the perfect book. One vial of Felix Felicis. Congratulations. That might. Yeah, well done. Well done, Ali. I like All I did was follow a bit. I like to use bun buns and burners. I thought you gave that to Dobby. But who was a half blood prince? Oh, he put his ring in the book. I know Professor Slughorn is most impressed with you. It's because he made Lady liquid, luck. liquid death. But I notice you spend a great deal of time with Miss Granger. I can't help wondering if... Oh, no, no, I mean... No, oh. she's not my type, not at all. I was merely being curious. <laughs> but enough chit-chat. You would be as well, you'd be like, what's going on? What you were looking at are memories pertaining to one individual, Voldemort. Oh, so he's like distilled all his memories into... contains the most particular memory. Pretty cool. Wish I could do that. I'd like you to see it, if you would. Can you not just tell him about it? But oh, it's better if he sees it, no? If you've got all these stored up and you can show other people it. I know, but it's just like, what if he uses it and then he can't get it back? Oh, well, I'm sure Dumbledore knows what he's doing. He's Dumbledore. It's like a long drool. It's like you in the morning. Yo! I would love that. How sick would that be? But also, we've got phones that do pretty much the same thing. Have we seen what he looks like? Before Weird Face. Mm hmm Well, we have. Okay, I, I couldn't remember. Yeah, Chamber of Secrets. 
God, he looks like Nickelback. <laughs> the entirety of Nickelback. No. All of them. Just the lead guy. Oh, little Tom. Oh, close the door. No. I'm a wizard. <laughs> I'm not mad. Hogwarts is not a place for mad people. Hogwarts well, other than the blonde guy. A school for the gifted. I can make animals do what I want without training them. Play good. Play useful. I would like I can that make one. Them hurt if I want. <clears throat> See, some people do deserve to hurt. I've said this before. That's why you're Slytherin. Prove it. Why are you showing the child that you can set things on fire randomly? My Dumbledore's a beast. <laughs> You're a wizard, Tom. I can speak hey. to snakes too. Whisper things. Snakes? Is that normal snakes. for someone like me? It's not normal, but it does happen. It's not really magic, is it? Well, I mean, I can do it. It's definitely a strange first encounter. Oh well, yeah, he's a weird kid. Did you know, sir? Then? Did I know I just met the most dangerous dark wizard of all time? If he knew, he probably would have killed him. Tom Riddle grew close to one particular teacher. I think he would have. No, he's too kind, isn't he? Might be. Yeah, it was the, 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 the thingy guy. Potions guy. You said Professor Slughorn would try to collect me. I did. Do you want me to let him? Yes. That sounds like a very Catholic church, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, I instantly this priest is going to touch this choir boy I don't like it. I was like, what, what do you mean by collect? <laughs> nice try, Death Eaters. Yeah, take that, Mike. Punch it. Here are my... Tweety Pies. They're called Yin and Yang. I wonder what he's been told to do. Do you think Tom Riddle was a Half-Blood Prince? Do you think Voldemort's Half-Blood? I can't imagine it. Maybe him? No, because Voldemort wanted to kill the Mudbloods. No, because that Blood Prince wrote on the bloody potion book. Mm. It'll be him, he's a diddy. Sort of microphone. Oh! Oh! I wonder if it's a portal! That's the same one that was in the, 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 the Di Diagon Alley. But what is he up to? Maybe that's a portal, maybe they opened the portal. Gonna be putting you all through a few drills just to assess your strengths. Uh, quiet, please. This is what you get for having your behind the scenes classes. <sighs> now then, remember, just because you made the team last year does not guarantee you a spot this year. Is that clear? Per wood. Good. Mess wood. Aww. I think you could introduce me to your friend Granger. Wouldn't no. Mind, uh, getting on a first name basis, know what I mean? Where were you the past four years? Ha! Huh? You That's missed a... your chance to shoot your shot. You were in the same bloody house as her. Well, I mean, she was a bit young for relationships back then. And well, he's kind of cute. Could have got to know her. There's plenty of other girls for Ron. It's true. He's a bit of a chad, though. Although he can't be that bad. He is a Gryffindor. Well. Could be worse. Could be a Slytherin. I'm not Slytherin, okay? They said it, not me. Oh. They said I'd be a Gryffindor. Which to me just proves that they don't know who I am. Come on, Ron! Yeah, doink. See, he's managing it. Use your strength! He's got this, see? I mean, the keepers quite often get the worst of it, don't they? Do it for Hermione! Hermione! <laughs> Hermione. Hermione? You'll never get her name right, will you? <laughs> oh, excuse me. Anyone could do that, really. <laughs> it is saving them. I don't know about that last one, though. It was unorthodox, but... It's got a bit of a thing for you, Hermione. Cool, Mac. He's vile. Oh, very nice. But she does tend to go for the jock kind of guys. By accident, but she does. And if you had a shred of self-respect, you'd hand that book in. Why? It's even better than you, Hermione. Slughorn thinks he's a genius. That's why she doesn't like it, though, because she's top of the class because she's got I brain. I don't know who that book was. Let's have a look, shall we? No. 
But surely if the recipes in your book the aren't is fragile. right, the binding is fragile. Then you should re-release the book. Who's the Half-Blood Prince? Who? That's what it says right here. This book is property of the Half-Blood Prince. Well, I don't Billy Harry. He also had to get enough of that. I don't think he even knows. I don't know. Like, oh, you're cheating because you've got an annotated book. All right, how about you get an annotated book too, huh? I mean, it really is an annotated book. Yeah. Well, I've got a nice chat before I go to bed. Now you do is read that bloody book. It's like being with a mining. <laughs> Couldn't find a reference anywhere to a half-blood prince. Yeah, because it's probably some nickname. Hoping to find you in the three broomsticks. Ah, uh, no. Uh, emergency choir practice, I'm afraid, Horace. <laughs> Bit strange. Something to drink? Um, three butter beers and some ginger in mine, please. Butter beer sounds so delightful. Yeah, I don't know what the heck is meant to be, but. We need to go to Harry Potter land. Is that what? a real thing? Yeah, it's in London. Really? Yeah. But it might have spoilers, and I'm not finished the movies. Honestly, we're all only holding hands. Ah! Listen, your sister's a loud action. I like to leave. What? Oh, shut up! I'm drinking butter beer. If she looked over here and saw you stalking me. Would you expect her to get up and leave? Yo! Bob! Now he can't get it out of his head though. Me snogging you? What? What? <laughs> All hands on deck, Granger. <laughs> Would you be game? Uh, I'd consider it an honour, sir. Mm. Explain you like a fiddle. I'd be delighted, sir. Splendid. Look for my owl. Sorry, Weasley. Good to see you, Wallenby. Wallenby? <laughs> oh, brother. Get to know him, Dalai. It must be important. If it wasn't Dumbledore, wouldn't ask. That's the Hermione's mission. Hermione's loving that. <laughs> She's cranking through that. God, a little bit. Listen, she obviously liked it enough to be like, uh, can we do another take of this and refill my mug? Uh. Did you hear what she was saying back at the pub about me and her snogging? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Ron. Jesus. Oh my, what the hell? What's okay, the what's in that drink? That's some creepy, yeah. Oh my God. What is she Dutch? Don't get any closer. Get back, all of you. Well, thank God Dumbly Doo is here. What the hell? That's how I could attend. <laughs> I always mix those two up. What? Don't touch don't it, Hattie. Touch Except for the rapids. Or maybe just don't touch it at all. Pretty necklace. Oh, Minerva. She said it was important that she deliver it. Did she say to whom? To Professor Dumbledore. Hmm. Yikes. So that was for him, eh? Why is it when something happens, it is always you three? I was gonna say the same thing! I've been asking myself the same question for six years. It wasn't to do with them, though. They were just walking. Yeah, they were in the way, though, weren't they? If she was delivering that to Professor Dumbledore, she wasn't doing it knowingly. Yes, she was cursed. Well, it was what is Malfoy. it? Oh, come on! That is a very serious accusation. That is a very serious accusation. Imagine just whipping that one out. No evidence. I just know. Oh, no, you can't do that. If only that worked in court. Oh, just know what's him. Oh, I've seen him walk into a room. Even that doesn't work. How grand it must be to be the chosen one. Don't look at Snape like that, Minerva. Had he given that death stare? He was running his hands all over my sister, wasn't he? Something snaps. You've got to hate him, you know? <laughs> Wouldn't know what I was just there. She's smart, funny. Attractive. Attractive? Like, Yo, Hattie, you can't be saying that to me. You're saying Dean's dating my sister because of her skin? Well, no, I mean, I'm just I'm just saying it could be a contributing factor. She's a whole package, Ronald! Hermione's got nice skin. Oh, Jesus, here we go. I've never really thought about it. But, I suppose, yeah. Yes, Ron, she's got nice skin. Hattie's got too much other things on his mind than to worry about I girls. I'll be going to sleep now. Right, yeah. 
Two of them sitting there pitching tents. Yeah. There's no way I'd be able to go to sleep while Malfoy was just cutting about the castle. Mm-hmm. In fact, I'm meant to go hunting with him and the Minister for Magic over the whole Why is it oh. always profiteroles? It's always the profiteroles. We're getting profiteroles tonight. Okay. I'm sorry. Is he working on anything new? I don't know. He and my dad don't get on. Probably because my dad says potions are rubbish. You're not getting a vape back, so. My parents are dentists. Respectable. Respectable profession. Fascinating. And is that considered a dangerous profession? No. It should be. Although, People make it bite. one boy, Robbie Fenwick, did bite my father once. He needed ten stitches. <laughs> They're all like, what's, what stitches? Ah, Miss Weasley, come in, come in. Where have you been, young lady? They've been fighting again, her and Dean. Sorry, I'm Aww. not usually late. Ah, how, how gentlemanly of you, Harry. Harold. Just in time for dessert. That is if Belby's left you any. <laughs> Wait, why did he stand up just then? He's been polite. How is that being polite? Because it is. Oh, okay. Never heard of that. It's because you're not a man. <laughs> <laughs> I hope not. Oh, he's making eyes at her Hermione. There's a lot of uh, teenage hormones flying about this movie. Oh, yes. Just admiring your hourglass. That is a oh, cool yeah. hourglass. Even if it went the same way. As for some of your classmates, well, let's just say they're unlikely to make the shelf. <laughs> sir. The photo frames. But then again, you already are someone, aren't you, Harry? Maybe he's born with it. You knew him, didn't you, sir? Tom Riddle? You were his teacher. Oh, God, the oh. conversation's going to get funny now on the hourglass. It's only natural you should want to know more. But I'm afraid I must disappoint you, Harry. I feel like everyone would want to know more. He was a quiet, albeit brilliant boy committed to becoming a first-rate wizard. Not unlike others I've known. I can't imagine that being his first time meeting him, though. Because when Dumbledore met him, he was a very different boy. Depends what year he was teaching, you know. Oh, it stopped. And when Dumbledore first met him, he was just a kid. Mm -hmm. Like, younger than first year. On, you're on. What's wrong with this hat? Everyone is such a bully in this school. Loser. What's he wearing? Loser. Why is he wearing a hat? To protect his brain box. That's just like Squid Game. <laughs> I'm a Squid Game eggs and toast. How was what? Your dinner party. Pretty boring, actually. Though I think Harry enjoyed dessert. What was for dessert? Your sister. Oh wait. <laughs> She's got a nice skin. <laughs> I expect you'll be bringing McLaggen. He's in the slug club, isn't he? Slug club. Good luck today, Ron. I know you'll be brilliant. Oh, oh she's really intense then. I know you'll be brilliant. McLaggen can have my spot. Have it your way. Please. Sure. What is she wearing? She's a Gryffindor Gryffindor. Is that why you put something in his cup? For God's sake, shut up. Carl, oh. shut up! You put the liquid luck in his cup. Don't drink it, Ron. No, he didn't. This is a bamboozle. You could be expelled for that. I don't know what you're talking about. It's in his pocket still. Come on, Harry. We've got a game to win. You're doing that thing where you make someone think that there's a placebo effect. Yeah, because you could see it in his pocket. It was shining. I think that was the thing, though. I think he was like, oh, yeah, this is what I put in your pocket, in yeah. your, your drink. Let's see how good you are. Naturally. Hermione, need, she just needs to calm down. Hermione. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Woo! Yeah, he gave him confidence. From his own heart. Holy boy. Ollie boy! Yeah, Hermione's like, Ah, oh, well, it's not actually Ronald, but it is. <laughs> Doesn't matter anyway, Quidditch is won by the Seeker. The rest of it's just fluff. Oh! oh. Ouch. Ouch. 
Does Malfoy not not play for Slytherin anymore? <laughs> I love the slow motion. Wait, it's like, wait, it's like, wait, it's like. It's all a dream, right? <laughs> and then he comes and walks through again. And then he woke, and then he woke up. Oh, this has to be a dream, hundred percent. Gotta be. You shouldn't have done it. I know. I suppose I could have just used the confounders, John. Uh oh. That was tryouts. This was an actual game. Didn't even use it. <laughs> didn't put it in. How many thought you did? Was he more fat? Oh! Damn! He's got a keg of beer. Oh, Hermione. You don't know what you got till it's gone. Oh, Harry, how can you be so stupid? What? Just the way he was like, huh, that's, that's weird. What, what's wrong with her there? Oh, Hermione. You always think you have time to, like, build a relationship and then they go and they just screw someone else and it's never the same again. Anyway. Yes, I had high school things too, you know. Just practicing. She's a Disney princess. How does it feel, Harry? When you see Dean with Ginny. Oh, she knows. Oops. Oh, that's brutal. I think this room's taken. Yeah, maybe go and find somewhere else to canoodle. Uh oh. A pugno. <laughs> yeah, get lost, Ron. I oh, brill. She just exploded her birds. Did you see a second ago though, when he he sat next to her and he did that on her knee? It was just yeah. kind of cute. Oh, it's all falling apart. It feels like this. Oh, Harry. Sorry, it's just a high school thing. Don't worry about it hard you know i remember i really liked a boy for so long and i thought he liked me too and i finally got the courage to ask him to dance and he said he had just started seeing someone else that broke my heart oh i really did i just remembered not knowing what to say and pretending i didn't like them and being like oh, oh I don't I'm like you it's, anyway it's you totally know what fine. I mean, yeah. it's just because we get on so well you know i thought it'd be fun bye Cry, cry, cry. Oh. Yeah. He's a perfect liberty to kiss whomever he likes. I really couldn't care less. <laughs> Harry's like, I'm stuck in the middle, no. Now, given the circumstances, I've had to make other arrangements. Have you? Uh oh. Wait, that guy? No, please. Chadley. Who are you going with? Chadley. Um, it's a surprise. Uh oh. Why was it, it was a surprise for her last year, too. She never tells them anything. She's only interested in you because she thinks you're the chosen one. But I am the chosen one. <laughs> <laughs> make hay, Harry. Make hay. Ask someone I like. Someone cool. Yeah! Oh, yay! They make a great couple anyway. They're both edgy. I was going to say the Slytherin girl. I sleepwalk, you see. That's why I wear shoes to bed. <laughs> She's a loony. Anyone going with you, buddy? Cause I wouldn't. I'm just gonna stroke my snake by myself. Nobody else wants to stroke my snake. I button my bottom button because I'm a loser. I <laughs> hate <laughs> <He's> a bully. <laughs> I will bully young children, okay? I'll do it! I'm crazy. <laughs> no, I don't know how I deal with it either. Just don't ask. He's not always like this, I promise. Told you it was a teleporting box. Voldemort said that the snakes were like attracted to him as well, didn't they? And then he's dealing with snakes too. Oh, only a nectar, passes. Well, yeah, because Slytherin's a snake, isn't it? Isn't it, bruv? Oh, no. That's disgusting. <laughs> they've, got, they've got a way Drink. in. Why are you surfing drinks, Neville? It's okay though. He's got Bill behind the hotels in the loo. I'm, I'm fine, mate. Thanks. Okay. Aww. I did take a drink. 
I'd have taken a drink too. He offered it to you. And it lightens your mate's load. I mean, we left Cormac under the mistletoe. Cormac? Oh. I thought it would annoy Ron the most. It would. But she doesn't actually want to hang out with him though. Dragon Tartar. Oh, Dragon Tartar? Just as well. They give one horribly bad breath. <laughs> no! <laughs> Might keep Cormac at bay. Oh, God, here he comes. <laughs> <laughs> I've also been this girl too. <laughs> nice to cover for me, cover for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, you're eating those just, just normal? Dragon balls. Dragon balls? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you deserve that because you shady and I like you in the other movies. You've just bought yourself a month's detention, McLagan. Not <laughs> so quick. Oh, no! Like the Hattie was like, I'm escaping! You see, he's traveling. Uh -oh. And he won't return until term resumes. Why? Ah, he's so shady! Why would Dumbledore leave Hogwarts? Hands off me, filthy squib! Ooh, call him a squib! I'll escort him out. Certainly. That's like Dumbledore escorting Harry somewhere. I feel like Harry would look at that though and be like, Hmm, I oh know. I don't need protection. Yes, you I do. I was chosen for this. Out of all others, me. You're a useful fool. You attempt to conceal it, but it's obvious. Let me assist you. Who's listening? I was chosen. This is my moment. This is my moment. Harold. Oh, come on, who else would be snoopy doopy? Like a Scotland! Unbreakable vow. Oh, we get some snow this year. Wait. It's just you can't break an unbreakable vow. That's kind of the point, mate. Oh, bloody hell. That wasn't very nice. Maybe she's too keen. Oh. She has a keen bean, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, she's still going. No one to walk away. Oh god. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, she wants lovely. to take a stop me. My lips are getting chapped. Look, and I'll take your word for it. <laughs> <laughs> well then. <laughs> Mine's a way punch her in the face. What happens if you break an unbreakable vow? Die. Well then. Well, you better not be giving that vow to any of your All little girls then. Draco Malfoy oh god, me. you can just imagine, wouldn't you? Dumbledore trusts Snape, therefore I do. Dumbledore can make mistakes, he said. You're himself. blinded oh. by him. I'm not. Yes, you are. It's tough, isn't it? We can only place our trust in a handful of people. If we start fighting amongst ourselves, we're doomed. And that's just what Voldemort would want. Divide and conquer. I just want the owl. United we stand, together we fall or something. Divided we fall. Oh, hi, Jenny. Hello. Hey, Jenny. How's it going, Jenny? Oh, Dad's away. Dad approves. Open up, you. Oh! Can't you trust me? Any woman that feeds me men's pies has got my heart. <sighs> Any women? Well, no, I mean, you've got it right now, but, you know. Just Something happens to you and another woman decides to feed me mince pies. I can't see! Can't see what will happen. Just watch the movie. <laughs> you can feed me mince pies anytime you want. Okay, I'll do it later. Love you. I love you too. I love you. Ron, you may have just been the third wheel. I think that. maybe that was his point. Plus he had bigger mince pies, therefore... <sighs> Therefore, goodbye, Jenny. Hello, Ronald. To be honest, you don't want your best friend dating your sister. Nope. Because when he breaks her heart... Or eating small men's pies when he could be easily eating a bigger one. It's not been easy. Well, this is muggle artifacts. As for Draco Malfoy, I know a bit more. Oh? The object that Draco is so interested in is a vanishing cabinet. A vanishing cabinet? Wait, why does Draco want it, though? Why would he care? He's not being chased. I think that you can transport yourself between the cabinets. 
And there's one in Hogwarts. Obviously the one that he put the apple in. Mm-hmm. So obviously the um, the things are not able to get into Hogwarts because of the barrier. But they can get to the Weasleys. Has one gone to bed? Um, not oh, yet. Is this when you shoot your shot, Jenny? Shoelace. See, she kind of likes him too. They would say that they've been arguing and stuff, so that means you move on instantly. Merry Christmas, Harry. Merry Christmas. Here's your second kiss. Oh, oh man, the world's just... Gosh darn it! Superman, what? Oh, no. Why is the Death Eaters caught walking now? Oh, Bellatrix. Don't chase her, that's what she wants! Nah, Harry Potter wants in on that action. Why don't you just use your wands to stop him? Jenny. Jenny's a wizard! Oh, I didn't think she'd go after him though. That's not very nice. No. Should make a song about the people you killed. I've never made a song about I don't even I've think killed. he's dead, so joke's on you. You didn't convince me. Still not seen the body. I hope I'm right. May it still be never after. I hope I get the like, yes, moment. Oh god, I feel like sentencing him to Jenny. <clears throat> My name is Jenny. Harry. Get, oh, get someone's name, name right. <laughs> Jenny. Jenny. Oh, that was Jenny. No, Jenny. Jenny and Hermione. Oh, Hermione is just not. Oh, oh it's him. The, the, the Wolverine's brother. Sabretooth. <laughs> oh, he done it with a smile as well. What oh, a cutie. Yeah, stupefy. It's like, don't, 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 It's like a 90s boy band. Yeah. So you get swamp foot. <laughs> well, not much they can do about it right now. Oh. oh, I don't like this. Why has she separated him anyway? Divide and conquer, I told you. Oh, here we go. Oh. It's all right. How do you protect her? Oh, if anything happens to Mr. Weasel, I'll be really sad. Oh, she better not just be going around picking people off because I'll kill her. Isn't there usually three though? That's two. That's true, they do normally go in packs of three. Who's? Yeah, like three. Oh no! Oh no, mum! And where's Ron? Oh, they're okay. Thank God. And the brothers. You forgot about the brothers? Oh, I just expected they were living in a mansion or something now. Aww, that's always where they all go. It's only stuff, Molly. You're bloody lucky you weren't killed. Sorry. You have to realise who you are, Harry. I know who I am, Hermione, all right? Yeah, you just got their house exploded. That's my one one. Excuse me, I have to go and vomit. <laughs> I feel like someone's fed her one of those love potions or something. Maybe she figured out how to make it. And took it herself? Yeah. So as per usual, Dumbledore... Wait, is he not travelling? Is he just in... No, he says he's coming back at the start of term. Right. By the way, thank you for the pineapple. You're quite right. It is my favourite. But how did you know? Hmm. Intuition. That boy has, like, perfect skin. It's quite scary. Pineapple. Something on your mind, Tom? Yes, sir. How does Dumbledore have this memory? I was in the library the other night. In the restricted section. Not allowed now, it's restricted. I beg your pardon? I don't know anything about such things, and if I did, I wouldn't tell you. Now get out of here at once! Uh-oh. This memory has been tampered with by the same person whose memory it is, our old friend Professor Slughorn. How'd you get it, though? Why would he tamper with his own memory? I suspect he's ashamed of it. Why? Why indeed? Well, he kind of kicked off suddenly, didn't he? I want you to persuade him to divulge his true memory. Any way you can. God, we're not that close. <laughs> Just gonna have to try, brother. This memory is everything. Without it, we are blind. So they want to know the name. What the magic was. Yeah. Mm. 
You need to stop like digging into that. That's why your hand's going black. No, I think his his hand was fine because of the memory thing. Right up you go. Please. So don't forget your tail. Let me guess. A brand new teacher and he's not so squeaky clean. Uh -huh. Well, they knew he wasn't squeaky clean, that's why they brought him back, I know. What do I owe this pleasure? Well, he's not a dark arts, anyway. The Prince of Potions. But it just got me wondering, are there some kinds of magic you're not allowed to teach us? Hmm. Good question. He and I don't exactly see eye to eye, sir. What I mean to say is... Well, he's not like you. Ah, let's see. Buttered him up a little bit. Give the you're compliments. Not like, you're not like the other boys, Professor. I suggest you do the same. Is that what you told Tom Riddle, sir, when he came? Oh, for God's sakes, Harry! Harry! You've gone too far, too fast. Dumbledore put you up to this, didn't he? Maybe. Not very good, Harry. Didn't he? Maybe. I never said yes! Crap. I failed. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm busy at the moment. Break the door down! Uh oh. oh. Okay. Either he's having a great pee. What has she given you? It was on your bed, the box. I just thought I'd try one. Or 20. Oh no. It's the love potion that was. I think I love her. Who? You know who? Do you think she knows I exist? I bloody well hope so. She's been snogging you for three months. Snogging? Yeah, it's definitely not her. Who are you talking about? Amilda, of course. What? Amilda oh. Vane. That was, that was, that's who was making the love potion for Harry. It's no joke. I'm in love with her. All oh, right, fine, you're in love with her. Have you ever actually <laughs> met her? Oh. Do you know what she looks like? How can you be in love if you never met her? Whoops, the daisies. Well, I did say it was on Harry's bed and he ate one or 20 million, yeah. so. Hermione warned ya. I'm gonna introduce you to Romilda Vane. For God's sakes. Well, she clearly done a good job of her potion. Thinking sweet thoughts of you. Where's Romilda? What's the matter with Wimby? <laughs> Wimby? Very well. Better bring him in. Oh, Wimby. I thought this called for more practiced hands, sir. Hello, darling. <laughs> Perhaps you're right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I expect you're tired of it after all these years. All the questions about Voldemort. Don't use that name. Oh, come on. Everyone knows his back. What's he going to do? Up here. <laughs> <laughs> Oopsies. Yeah, my boy. Bottoms up. What's this? Tonic for the nerves. Tonic for the nerves. I hope it tastes good. Oh no. What happened to me? Well, you gotta drink all of it. Surely not just a swig. <laughs> Wine, dazzling oak matured mead. I had other intentions. Prosecco? Given the circumstance. White moi? Oh, he's whipped out the, the good stuff. Yeah, Potter. Life. Cheers. Oh, for <laughs> Oh, oh. Ron. <laughs> Wait, what did you give him? Professor, do something. I, I, I don't understand. Recovery position? Wait. As I say, he's not doing this on purpose so that he can snoop around, is he? I was going to say, you don't think it's like... Oh no, he's just giving him something. Wakey wakey. <coughs> oh, thank God, don't do that to me. What did you give him? They're gonna kill me. Yeah, it <laughs> seems that way. And him. Was it the drink? Oh, get out of here, Snape. You must be very proud of your student, Horace. Oh, Snape didn't like that. By the way, he possesses remarkably subtle hints of licorice and cherry. Mm. Actually, I had Wait, so that was made for Harry, which means that maybe that would have ended up for Harry. To you, headmaster. Oh. Where's my one-one? Has he been asking for me? No. I have 
happen to be his girlfriend. I happen to be his friend. friend. <laughs> He's been poisoned, you daft dimbo. And for the record, I've always found him interesting. Oh, have you though? See, he senses my presence. Oh, for God's sakes. Girls, you're doing this in front of the teachers. Let's go see Hermione, isn't he? What are you gonna say? Uh, Run up. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> well then. Yeah, um, everyone leave the room. Oh, come away everybody. Mr. Weasley is well tended. Ah, oh, youth is wasted on the end. Ah, uh, Dumbledore. About time, don't you think? Yeah, about time, Jenny. About time, uh, yep. Yeah, about, about time. About time. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Probably happy with yourself, Hermione. Just broke up young love. She is the young love. Well, I mean... So what did he say about the headmaster in regards to the poison? Oh, the bottle talking. was a gift that he was going to give. The headmaster. Oh. And that's why I was like, he was like, I didn't get it as a gift. I was going to give it. So, oh, there's the white one! What have we done with the white one? Why do I feel this is like a room of requirements thing? Are you, are you, do you not have the Marauder's map? You were looking at it earlier. See if his bird ends up dead. So help me God, blonde kid! Why do I keep thinking his name's Leroy? <laughs> Leroy <laughs> Malfoy! <laughs> and I'll be okay, birdie. I promise I'll be okay. We'll come back cooked. Or not come back at all. God, the things you do just to get those stupid people in this school. You're just, like, why can't you see it? It's just being used. Is it back? Is it dead? Oh, oh! Can you use real life feel? <clears throat> we no. don't like him. No. No. As I'm turning the movie off like that time the other thing died. That didn't die because it came back. Why are you just pointing your wand? Oh. You're making it snow. It's just as dangerous. <laughs> I was wanted to be like, oh, is it snowing inside? Don't get me wrong, I'm bloody thrilled to be shot of her. It's, she seems a bit put out. Well. She was ready to kill you. Well, that spoon. You say you don't remember anything from that night? Anything? <sighs> Just tell him what he said! I was completely boggled, wasn't I? I Do you remember hugging the teacher, Ronald? Harry. Sectum Semper. For enemies? But who is the half blood? Because I don't know who cursed me. I've been trying to remember. Honestly. Uh oh. Here comes someone. Like, what have you been doing this entire movie anyway? Not suspicious at all! When the violins are... A crescendo! <laughs> That's what Esther does. Oh, you do, what'd you do with the black one? I don't think the black one made it either. Wait, you're gonna put yourself in the box now? Or, cause that, that would be a great thing. <clears throat> I wonder if he is, though. I no don't... one cares about stupid old moaning Myrtle. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you did, Malfoy. You sniveling little weasel. Expera la duda! <laughs> Expera la duda! <laughs> Can we not have conversations anymore? Nope. Please stop trying to paralyze me. It's not nice. Whoa! Nelly. Yeah, bitch! 
Listen, but, I got a ghost friend in here too. But what does that spell do? You just read it in a book and thought, I'll, I'll, I'll do this spell. You could have chopped his toes off. You chopped his wiener off. Oh my god, his toes are gone. <laughs> <laughs> Taking all the colour out of the scene. Oh Jesus. What did you do? <sighs> Snape, I thought you were protecting. Hi, Snape. <laughs> I read it in a book. I know. Sorry. It came for me first! Yeah, but, like. Jeez, he nearly killed him! I mean, to be fair, you probably should cure him of whatever Hattie just did there. Well, I mean, you shouldn't just be whipping out spells that you just read in a book. Could have done anything. What about your, your um. What, what's the normal spell that they use? Axviliosta! Oh, of course, what was the point in asking you? <laughs> Expelliosis! Expelliarmus! Well done! Yay! <laughs> Y'all good me. Wait, I'm confused. How did they know that he was in there? The wrong requirement. I thought it was a real requirement. I said that. Me. This guy. We need to Wait, is that the mirror of Arasad? From the first one? Where no one will ever find it. Including you. Here you go. Arasad, Arasad. Wait, why are you putting the book in what there? That? Jinx her. Huh? They're going to find it. They're going to find a wee bird in a box. There's a bird in a box. Wait, what if it's dead in the other box and it's fine in this box and it's a full thing? Hey! Oh, cute. See? You never know what you'll find up here. But why you want to get rid of the book? Just because Harry decided... Might find love. Just because Harry decided to, like, try and kill Malfoy. Well, he didn't know what it was gonna do. Which actually is another reason as to why you don't just say random spells. Well, yeah. Close your eyes. This is a bamboozle. Don't trust her. Might touch you in your special place. <laughs> you never had a love story in your life, did you? I did. Oh, probably, but I mean, my brain's that addled from the alcohol and the illegal narcotics. He's like, is that it? I stay hidden up here too, if you like. Opens his eyes and snapes there. <laughs> 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 Mr. Potter. <laughs> Give me the book, Mr. Potter. Did you and Ginny do it then? Jesus! <laughs> Not yet, wrong, maybe in a couple of days. Oh. Oh my god, what if she actually did get in the box? Because it sounded like a creak. If she got in the box. Still no luck with Slughorn then, I take it. Luck. Uh oh. All I need a bit of luck. Hmm. That's a lot of luck though. Just take a sip. You don't need to have all of it. Well, maybe it doesn't need all of it. Maybe it doesn't work if it only takes a sip. Look at that. That's a lot. You know what I would do if I took that? I'm so lucky. I'd make some more. That's what I'd do with my luck. Make some more. Well, <clears throat> how do you feel? Excellent. Lucky! These wee things aren't even empty. I've got a really good feeling about Hagrid. I feel it's, it's the place to be tonight. Do you know what I mean? I'd go with it. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Or Felix does. Uh oh. Hi. I want some whatever you're taking, brother. I mean, that's not luck. That's just straight up like happiness. Oh. Oh, taking some clippings, are we? <gasps> I love that. I was like. Hello! <laughs> Are those tentacular leaves, sir? They're very valuable, aren't they? Ten galleons a leaf to the right by her. What are you making with tentacular leaves? Personally, sir? these plants always kind of freak me out. Mm. Yeah, I gotta say, if that was on the kitchen window, nah. I'd throw them over yeah, the I'm off to Hagrid's, you see. He's a very dear friend, and I just fancy paying him a visit. So if you don't mind, I will be going now. Oh. Surely you realise I can't allow you to go roaming the grounds by yourself? Well, I'm I'm we'd come along, sir. I love his behavior, like <laughs> his stance and like everything. 
Accompany me back to the castle immediately. That would be counterproductive, sir. But what makes you say that? Because no he's going to Hagrid. No idea. Just got a hunch. Oh my god. Oh. Merlin's beard. Is that an actual acromantula? Whatever it is, burn it with fire. Thank you. Must have been one of uh, Aragog's kiddies. Kill it. <laughs> Eldest friend he was. I'm so sorry, I didn't... Oh, uh... don't worry yourself, you're not alone. Oh, is that Aragog? The eyes, I reckon, they unnerve some folk. Not to mention the pincers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I reckon that too. Hagrid's like, what the hell are you on? Would you allow me to extract a vial or two, purely for academic purposes, you understand? I don't think it's dead. Those has got to do much good now, is it? But my thoughts exactly. No. Ampoule or two about my person for just oh, such watch. occasions as this. Oof. Any... No, I don't like this. Magnificent he was. Just magnificent. Aww. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs> Hagrid's been a bit sus here, though. Is it actually dead? Oh, yeah. He just ripped the bell off it. Would you to say a few words? You can yes. rip things off anything. You had a family, I trust? Oh, yeah. Poor Aragog. How did Harry know to be here, though, this place to be? The luck. Farewell, Aragog, <laughs> king of the arachnids. <laughs> Dog. Your body will decay, but your spirit lingers on. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. It's okay. Drugs are just bam, which was One afternoon I came downstairs and it vanished. Off. Oh. It's very odd, isn't it? That's a little bit odd. I suppose you, you go along and then Suddenly, poof, poof. I don't know though, my dog is still here. He's not just going poof. Might do. No, well, now I'm scared. Yeah, we know. We don't have stairs to come down from to go poof. What was that? What was what? What was what? Oh, he fell asleep and he smacked his head. Yeah. Just before it reached the bottom, it's transformed to a wee fish. Oh. The flower petal had come from a lily. Oh. The day I came downstairs, the day the bowl was empty. Oh no. I know why you're here, but I can't help you. It would ruin me. No, oh, Harry. Because her love was more powerful than Voldemort. Don't say his name. I'm not afraid of the name, Professor. I'll oh, say it. I'm going to tell you something. It's just a bloody name anyway. I need to know what Tom Riddle asked you all those years ago in your office, and I need to know what you told him. Be brave, Professor. I've got to be brave. Good for you, Harry. Just being like, come on, dude. You disgrace her. Oh. Otherwise, she died for nothing. Oh, Otherwise, not the bowl will remain empty. If he tells you, Harry, you need to make him a new fish. That was savage, though, what you just said there. Talk about pressure. Well, that's it. You bottle him up and then burned. That creeps me out every single time because it looks like worms, like, yeah. coming out, you know? That's nice, though, that we held hands together while they did it. Yeah. I don't blame you. You were just a nice teacher. It's called, as I understand it, a Horcrux. 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 I'm not sure what you were reading, Tom, but, but this is very dark stuff. Very dark indeed. Tell him nothing then. He's gonna be crazy. A Horcrux is an object in which a person has concealed part of their soul. But I don't understand how like it works. Like a lich. What, phylactery? Why do you need to understand how it works? That part of your soul that is hidden lives on. In other words, you cannot die. So is that what you used the book? Remember the book in the second one? How does one stretch his soul, sir? I'd be like, you don't need to know this stuff. Murder. Oh. 
Seven. Merlin's beard, Tom. Merlin's beard. To rip the soul into seven pieces. This is all hypothetical, isn't it, Tom? All academic. Oh, yeah, yeah, totally. It's for of course, uh, sir. project. It'll be our little secret. Yikes. And that's when he knew he had effed up. Yeah. <laughs> so has he done it seven, seven times? times? Is he a chair? What are they exactly? Could be anything. Most commonplace of objects. A ring, for example. Oh, that was the ring he was playing with. Another ring? Belonged to Voldemort's mother. Difficult to find. Even more difficult to destroy. Oh. Uh. If you did destroy each Horcrux... One destroys Voldemort. How would you find them? And how do you know what they're in? Whoa. Oh, yeah, Jesus! No, don't touch nothing! That's one way to find it. Try and touch everything, Harry. Everything in the world you must touch. That's like me to going into a shop. Especially a shop with delicate things. Bull in a china shop. I have to touch them all. There might be a Horcrux. It's where you've been going, isn't it, sir? When you leave the school. Yes. And I think perhaps I may have found another. Ah, so secretly you knew. Once again, I must ask too much of you, Harry. I'm Listen, Hattie's again. into this, you I'm know. Once again, asking for your help. I will not negotiate with you, Severus. You agreed. Nothing more to discuss. This is very. He's Halloween every day. He said he doesn't want to do this anymore. Do what, though? Oh, Harry. Don't want to do what? You need to shave, my friend. Ha! <laughs> You've got a bit of bum fluff. I forget how much you've grown. At times, I still see the small boy from the cupboard. Oh. I'm an old man. You still look the same to me, sir. <laughs> Doesn't to me. I feel like you hit a certain age and then you just don't age. You know? For me, it was 20. <laughs> You're laughing at <laughs> You must obey every command I give you without question. Yes, sir. You do understand what I'm saying? Yep. Should I tell you to run, you run. Should I tell you to abandon me and save yourself, you must do so. No, no, no. Can't promise that one. Your word, Harry. Run, you fool. My word. Just don't do the promise Take thing. No! No, he's gonna... He's so gonna... You couldn't operate within Hogwarts. See? Operate. Well, being me has its privileges. Oh, I thought I was going to do the promise no, thing. No, it's like do that. It literally <laughs> says, like, if you break the promise, you die. It's just zippity do that in a way. If you can't do that in Hogwarts, then what's the point? That's where he always is. Well, people can't go... Everyone else can't do it, so that they can't get within Hogwarts. Yo, oh, that was on the picture! So we only know two things then. We know the book and we know the ring. That's yeah, and he it. thinks there's another one here. This is the place. And Harry's signature glasses, they might be one. This place has known magic. His boxer shorts are his here. Knickers. This is where Voldemort hid his knickers. So no wonder your hands are mess, mate. Payment must be made. Payment intended to weaken any intruder. So I brought you. Your blood's much more precious than mine. I've got loads of it. I feel like Dumbledore has turned into some sort of dragon man. <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like he's indestructible. You're a lizard, Dumbledore. <laughs> Him and Hagrid are my faves. Voldemort will not have made it easy to discover his hiding place. He will put certain defences in position. Defence against the dark arts? Careful. Or the light arts? It's funny how the movie has literally, if you haven't even realized, it's now black and white. So funny. This is very dark, okay? Or do you want them to pull out Game of Thrones and just make it black? <laughs> Fire breath! There it is. The only question is how do we get there? Well, I am walking in water. Could be deep. Oh, he's got his vans on. I know. There's a lot of slippy slips. It's a bloody Jedi! I thought it was Gandalf, but no. Oh. He's pulling up a boat. It's gonna surf his way across. If you would, Harry. 
<laughs> Crack on. Might as well use your muscles, even though we've got magic. You wanted a boat? I hope you've got uh, some money to pay the ferryman. Ah, uh, I think he's in the bottom of the ocean. As you say, they're wizards. They've got all sorts of crazy magic, but we need a boat for this mission. Well, maybe there's some anti-magic coatings. He did say there was defences against the dark arts. Yeah, something tells me you don't want to touch that water. What is it, though? It's an original Game Boy. It's a really weird place to hide your toys. It is to be drunk. All of it. Why? Ron will do it. Why can't I drink it, sir? Because I'm much older, much cleverer, and much less valuable. Oh. You're like, I'm just we're, a kid. We're flexible, okay? <laughs> Bottoms up, dumbly doors. I'm sure it's just like white wine. Butterbeer. Man, see if I had to drink that much white wine. Ooh, oh, you'd be hammered. Hundred dragon. <laughs> no, tell me, keep going. Chug, 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 chug. Drink more! Oh, just just stick your mouth in it and make a wee, like, straw. Still got a ton to go. You, you gotta bring it to him, Harry! Professor. Bring him more! Just need to keep going. Maybe it's a potion that if you drink all of it, you're fine. But if you only drink a wee bit, you die. It's okay, Dumbly. You have to keep drinking like you said, remember? Come on, Dumbly! Maybe it starts poison and you get the, the antidote at the bottom. The antipoison. It will stop, but only, only oh, if you keep man. drinking. Don't make me I'm sorry, Aww, horrible. <laughs> Is he almost done or what? That is horrible. Oh, uh, what the hell? It's got like brains at the bottom. I promise I'll do it. You can do it, Dumbly! I promise. Please. Oh, just drink it, Dumbledore. Oh. See, you're okay. Are you okay? Harry. You smashed it. Harry. Water. I know you asked for water, like, what are you I'm doing? Empty. Oh, there you go. Water. Oh, no. Why is it not working? I won't scoop up any water. Oh my god. You can't give him that because it, it's dodge. I think he's falling into the, the... Oh no, I would not give him that. Lumos. Can you not just fill up some water out of your wand? I know, just go do do do. Or even do -do. like do do do. Do it in your hands or something if that thing's kid. Oh! <laughs> Shit, I Talk about curses! Don't give me any of that water. How we are. Lumos Maxima. Yeah, exactly, macaroni cheese. <laughs> oh my god. Goblins. It's golems. My precious. You stay away from Dublin! Oh, you just sect them separate them! Oh god. Oh god. Oh! Ah! That's it! He's one of them now. That was alright. Oh my god, yuck. Look how skinny it is! It's definitely not getting five a day. Oh! I think Dumbledore is yeah, here. Dumbledore's comfy. Jeez, uh, that's a lot of dead folk. Oh, look at him go! Something else, isn't he? He doesn't need no water. Oh. That is insane. He's just the best though. Dumbly door. I thought when he came in. You thought what? I thought the dog came in. Oh, you thought about it. What's happening at Borgen and Burks? And the the the. Oh, what did they call it? What's the shady part called? Nocturnally! 
Uh-oh. That's it. They're going to be away now. And they're going to make their way into Hogwarts. Hogwarts. All right, jeez. Oh, about a swishing? Go to your houses. No dawdling. Oh, no, McGonagall. This is what happens when Dumbledore goes away. The snakes will play. I think he's a pawn in all this. You know that. He's, he's a bad guy anyway, but I feel like this situation, he yeah, doesn't want it. Oh, you don't think he wants it? No, I think it's because of his dad. He's being forced to I do don't it. know. I think he does. I think he's just scared. For good reason. Oh my god. Oh no, Dumbledore's weak. Oh no. What does that mean? Severus is away, Nate. Wake him. Tell him what happened. What happened? Tell me. Well, there's five people in Hogwarts. Right? And he's weak. Oh, I thought you said he's awake. I was like, what? What, what does no, that mean? Oh, he's weak. Whatever happens, it's imperative you stay below. How do as I say? Trust me. Oh. I don't think he can. Like, if Dumbledore ends up in any situation, Harry's going to be there. You know it. Mm-hmm. My wee heart, like. Oh my god, Malfoy, really? These actions are so weak that you heart can't really have been in. He cost me. That's what you said. I, was I did, yeah. Ah. Oh, Draco. You were I chosen, but you didn't fire. want this. Stick around, Harry, please, because if he was to do anything, oh! You're not alone. There are others. <laughs> you brought others to Hogwarts. It has a sister, a twin. Mm. Morgan and Burks, they form a passage. Typical bad guy thing. I have to do this. You don't have to do nothing. Why, well, you don't do. have to prove anything to anyone. Everyone me. already hates you. Oh. Look what we have here. Oh my god. Well done, Draco. It's just the Dumbly doors. I told you his heart wasn't in it. Yeah. Do it! He doesn't have the stomach, just like his father. You know nothing about my father. The dark waters clear the voice. Oh, really? Why? Go on, Draco. No! He's there to protect him, but it doesn't mean he has to be there for the others. Yeah. I can't watch this! Oh, God. Dumbledore. Snape's a double agent. Why would he help Harry? Please. How about a cadaver? <gasps> ah! No! No! Double agent, are you sure about that? Nope. This is what you done. You've done this. I don't think he had a choice. I don't know. He doesn't look like he's exactly happy about it. Oh, Hattie. Don't you dare go anywhere near Hagrid! Oh, Hattie. <gasps> oh, piss off, you bitch! He belongs to the Dark Lord. He doesn't belong to anyone. I don't know. I don't know. It uh, used my own spells against me. He was the Half Blood Prince. I'm the Half Blood Prince. Well, thanks for your book, anyway. There's Where no, is everyone? Like, there's no reason for him to leave Harry like that. Oh God. Hagrid's there. What a waste. Someone as strong as that, just out a window, you yep. know? Ah, 
I feel like I hardly got any time with him. Oh, Dumbledore. I can't believe Snape did that. I feel like that was the worst thing that they could have ever done, though. Talk about making a martyr. I still want to feel like Snape's not evil. He just killed Dumbledore, how can he not be evil? Oh, I think Dumbledore was dead anyway. Why, because he's old? <laughs> no, because there was five of them there. Why would he leave Harry? Why would he save Harry under the thing and then leave him out in the open like that? Because he's dead. They're not supposed to kill him. Cause yeah, but they take him cap captive, surely. I don't know. Oh, Sherbet Lemons. So what does this mean? Like, Hogwarts has taken over now? No, I think they left. I think Dumbledore was their, their goal. If you should have the need to talk to someone. Oh. <sighs> Do you think he would have done it? Draco? No. No, he wouldn't have done it. He didn't want to be there. He was just getting used. It's fake. Oh. Oh, for God's sakes. It's not even a real bloody Horcrux. So it's not one of them? No. I have stolen the real Horcrux and intend to destroy it as soon as I can. But whoever they are, they have the real Horcrux. And they said they destroyed it. I know, but Dumbledore just died for no reason. Fun's okay with it, you know. You and Ginny. Oh. I've got to finish whatever Dumbledore started. I don't know where that'll lead me, but I'll let you and Ron know where I am. You think they're not coming? Always admired your courage, Harry. But sometimes you can be really thick. Yeah, like they would just let you go, bye. You need us, Harry. Yeah, do. Yeah, I've reacted to too many things today that have made me cry. Was that the phoenix? His birdie. Use a phoenix down! Don't think he's just unconscious. I know. God. What crap, Mimi? <laughs> Are you okay? No. I always ask you this. You're always in bits. I know. Oh. Oh, my snores are everywhere. Yeah, probably. Yeah, a snorty mess. It's funny how you can have watched like 12 hours of Harry Potter or Harry Potter. around. But you're still like, oh, I, I only just started seeing him yeah you know because he just started kind of interacting more obviously you've got all the main characters whereas he was always like in the background mm -hmm. and then it felt like he had like his epic scenes and and the epic scene in that one and then yeah he had that the fight against Voldemort and then for him to just go out the window like that well I mean he did use a daver de cadaver. Um, I don't care what daver he used. It was horrible. And that's what I'm saying to you. Like, when they took away Sirius. Sirius. In the last movie. Michael Gamble. That's the kind of thing I expect from a death. Mm. Where it's like you have time to process the sadness. Yeah. And the anger and the hurt and everything. Whereas in the last movie, it was so quick that it was hard to even be like... Is he gone? Yeah. You know, and where did his body go? Where is he gone? Sort of thing. Damn you, Snead. Snead. <laughs> You'll get someone's name right, eventually. <laughs> Wait, it's not Snead? Snead. <laughs> oh. I just keep changing the fourth letter. Yeah. <laughs> You're a snake in the last one. <laughs> oh, man. Serious. Sneed. Sneed. <laughs> Hermione. Hermione. Jenny. Jenny. 
And people think I do this like on purpose on my channel and it's not. It's literally like what I hear. You could tell her 15 times. I still won't get it. I have to believe that's happened. Don't believe the words. <sighs> so we've got two more to go. Two more to go. Then you said that's it's it. a part one and a part two. Which I mean, I don't know why, because these are all consistently. So this is part five, technically. Well, it's part one and part two of um, Deathly Hallows, I think it's called. Which is, uh, I think the reason it's part one and part two is I think it, it was just a single big book. Right. That came out. They'll so do a they matrix do. then, it'll get to like two hours and then they'll be like, they'll just stop at this horrible cliffhanger. Yeah, oh, yeah does the second matrix do that? Yeah. Is that, is that how they've done that? Yeah. Who's was the fourth Matrix? Mm-hmm. That's out, isn't it? Yeah, we watched it. What? Yeah, we've seen it. What? Yeah. We're Trinity and that we're older. <laughs> if I just memory hold this. We watched it. I cannot remember this movie. We watched it. Oh my God. After this ends, you need to tell me what happened to this movie. <laughs> <laughs> how can I not remember this? Maybe it was so bad you just blurted it out. What the hell? I've just like memory hold this entire movie. <laughs> I love it when that happens. That's crazy. Anyways, Harry Potter. Harry Potter! We'll be back tomorrow with the next one. And then that's Christmas Eve. And then Christmas Day, we'll have the finale of <laughs> Harry Potter. So I hope you guys are enjoying this journey with us i will say it's uh it's been a lot of work to get this like every single day to you guys so i hope you appreciate our marathon appreciate our talk and pesh like we always do and yeah and i hope you appreciate dumbledore because i do yeah my tears didn't appreciate that though okay Happy Christmas. We'll see you tomorrow for Christmas Eve Christmas and Eve tomorrow. tomorrow. Potter. Make sure you get in bed early for Santa. Santa. Leave some cookies out for your dad and some milk for your mom. What do you mean? We all know your parents just take Well, for Santa gets there. Yeah. But rude. That's what happens. Is that why they get no presents from Santa? That would make sense. Yeah, only the kids. Anyway, bye guys. See ya.